Hello, I have a 1991 or 1992 Bayliner Trophy, and I have a Force 120 horsepower motor on here, and I did have some trouble with overheating. Um, I did replace the thermostat shortly thereafter while testing it. I hit a rock in the bottom unit and had to have that fixed. Uh, my brother did a fantastic job helping me weld that back up and make everything work. So it appears it's working now. Um, but I did want to just show a picture of this engine running to show you what it looks like, I think, um, since there's not a, a telltale, you know, pier coming off of the engine anywhere like there is on most, uh, most engines like this one. Um, it's hard to know if the water's flowing accurately. Um, but I do see that um, you get exhaust out of here, but also this, this spits uh, water also. So it almost acts like a, a telltale, but uh, it's hard to know how much is supposed to be coming out of there. Um, I did just invest the Harbor Freight in one of these thermostats, but these are fantastic. You just um, aim it at the, with that red dot there at the head there and you can get the temperature. Of course, now it says 148. Uh, so I did just run this and it um, it went rapidly at idle up to 160 degrees, 162, and then started dropping immediately down to about 140 as the thermostat opened up. So the thermostat's working great. I can't say enough about, I mean, most of you people know it's obvious, but how valuable this tool is for that to be able to check the temperature in real time as opposed to putting your hand on it or to guesstimating whether it's overheating or not. But I'm gonna get a quick shot of here what it looks like while it's running so you can see how much water spitting out of the lower ports here. And I will say that I also did pull the head covers off to see if there was some blockage in there. And uh, it needed some cleaning up. I put a new head gasket on it, but it's uh, I didn't see anything obvious. Um, but here, you can see the temperature running at 135. You can see it's spitting out a fair amount of water, so that's a good sign. It means everything's moving through there well. Uh, no blockages. And I'm settling out of about. That helps some folks just in comparison to how your motor is performing. Thanks.